in general, you're not gonna take any of this to heaven. These are all earthly things. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about worshiping idols. If you're interested in this video, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that post notification bell. Let's get into the video. Let's get into the video. So the first thing is, let's start off with a verse. I have a verse in Leviticus 26, 1. Hold up, boo. I got you. It says, ye shall make you no idols nor graven image neither rear you up in a standing image neither shall you set up any image of stone in your land to bow down unto it for i am the lord your god i also want to let you know that the first commandment out of the 10 commandments of god he is literally your god like that is his first commandment and i just wanted to speak about it because there's so many different forms of idols and i'm here to tell you what it is tell you what i struggled with so that you also can just learn about it and have knowledge so that you will not perish so the different types of idols are sex money celebrities physical appearance significant other cell phones social media anything that you put first and you consume your most of your mind with and i want to tell you like worshiping the definition of worshiping is glorifying so if you feel that you glorify money like for instance you know some people may take pictures worship it you see like they hold it up as if it's like a god or something and i just want to say like when you live your life like that it takes away from putting God first because you're allowing money to consume your mind. You're allowing yourself to be a slave to money. Like you would do anything for it. You will like sacrifice certain things. You're like, oh, but you know, I really need money. So maybe I'll have sex for it. I'm not judging you. I'm just telling you what the effects of it can do. So I just want to tell you that at the end of the day, like put God first do not allow these idols to be in the front center these are things that have temporary feelings temporary attachments when in general you're not going to take any of this to heaven these are all earthly things these things don't matter at the end of the day yes we do need money we live in this world but don't put it at the center god will bless you with it god says seek him first and everything else will come after you don't have to seek all these things like he knows the desires of your heart he knows what you want he knows what you need so don't put these things first and i want to just talk about like physical appearance i feel like that's a huge one a lot of us we want to look a certain way we want to we idolize a person in their bodies and we want to look like this like that but i mean i think it's so important to want to be healthy i think it's important to want to look good to feel good but at the end of the day do not like make it everything i feel like when you idolize these things it also becomes a form of like discouragement it kind of makes you feel bad about yourself like if you struggle financially with money all the time it becomes like it makes you feel like stressed out like oh why i never have this you start comparing yourselves to other people that's another form like of jealousy you can develop that so it's just like so many things come with idolizing god is the only one that can give you true fulfillment he could give you peace he could give you joy he could give you happiness he could give you eternity stop consuming the things of this world yes it's very difficult because we do live in this world but through god all things are possible through god he's the only one that can fulfill us truly fulfill us so just if you find yourself you know idolizing your phone idolize being on social media and look i felt like that before i'm still praying about it and you know it's natural for us to just be like oh well 
you know, wake up first thing in the morning, you don't pray, but you go on your phone. And I want to just tell you, like, the first thing we should be doing is praying. We should be thanking God for another day. Thanking God for waking us up today because we could have died in our sleep. Also, God is a very jealous God. He is the creator. And he created you, me. And if you find yourself, like, doing things that doesn't consume of him, of course he's gonna be jealous if you out here worshiping money, if you out here worshiping like celebrities, like of course he's gonna be jealous because he created you, he created these people. So it's like just really, if, you, if it's something that you're struggling with, pray to him, ask him like God, like, and repent, like God, I repent. I noticed that I've been on social media more than ever. I've been on my phone more. I feel so attached to it, like I can't, let it go ask him to help you like repent ask for help he will help you so one thing that i used to idolize a lot was a significant other i wanted to be married so badly i just wanted to be married with my godly husband and i wanted my kids and i was just like that was just something that consumed my mind so much it was something i thought about i just woke up like oh am i gonna get a husband i will seek a man i would just go out kind of like looking for that guy and you know a lot of us do that we want to get married we want to be in relationships we want we want we want we want that's okay to want these things but when you desire it more than God, that's a form of idolizing. And, you know, just you just got to be patient and just really just put him first. Everything else will come. Like, everything else will come. And it's crazy because as I got closer to God, that um, feeling, that desire started to dissolve where I, I don't even care. Like, I'll, I still want to get married, but that's not the you can tell like that's not the thing that's on my mind i'm just so focused on my purpose i'm so focused on being used by god i'm so focused on my walk with god that i don't really care about that husband i care about it but it's not the the front center yeah that's what i meant, that's what I, meant. I still care but it's not the front center it's not something i desire more than anything else so it's just like just know that god will bless you with whatever that you want if it's a part of his will be patient but just put him first like these things are not going to heaven with you like your phone is not going to heaven with you spend time read his word worship him for what he has done like he is god lord of lord king of king there's no other name literally no other name above jesus himself so i just want to encourage you guys to put god first don't idolize these things and you know just seek him with all your ways and all your heart i hope you guys enjoy this video i was mad hyped today like i was like lord oh man hey Bell, yeah.